Hello, I'm Laura from Fox Tech. If you're trying to figure out how to increase the volume on your iPad, I've got a few simple steps to help you adjust it, whether it's for notifications, media, or general system sounds. The easiest way to increase the volume is by using the physical volume up button on the side of your iPad. Just press it until you reach the desired volume. However, if you want a little more control, swipe down from the top right corner of your screen to open the control center. From there, you can use the volume slider to adjust the sound more precisely. If you're noticing issues with alert or system sound specifically, you can go to settings, then sounds, and adjust the ringer and alert slider. This will control things like notifications and alarms. Now, if the volume still seems low, check to see if any Bluetooth devices are connected. Sometimes, headphones or speakers can be connected without you realizing, which could affect the sound. If you find a device connected, go ahead and disconnect it to ensure the iPad's internal speakers are being used. Also, make sure your iPad isn't in silent mode. You can check that in the control center or for older models by using the physical side switch if your iPad has one. When it comes to actually making the speakers louder, there aren't a lot of hardware options. You can clean the speaker grills to ensure nothing is blocking the sound. You could also use a little physics hack. Placing your iPad in a bowl or similar object can amplify the sound by bouncing it outward. It's simple, but surprisingly effective. If you're using a specific app, don't forget to check the in-app volume settings. Sometimes, apps like YouTube or music players have their own volume controls, so make sure those are turned up as well. Finally, if none of these solutions work, it might be worth restarting your iPad. A quick restart can clear up any temporary issues that could be affecting the sound. Thanks for watching. I hope this helped you get the volume where you need it. If you found this video useful, don't forget to like and subscribe for more helpful tips. See you later.